time once again, baby. Another episode of This Old Outboard coming right at you. All right, baby. She going in the water. Nasty, I gotta wash all this off. Is she going in the water? I think it's gonna be all right. We'll find out here shortly. So I just went over and cleaned everything, all the grease and crap from the being in the tank. And this thing, is the, every inch of this thing has been spray painted, touched up. Right here, you know, I was hitting some grease that was up in here, a little brake cleaner. You can see it just, just ate that spray paint right off. You can see here, they just painted right over the decal. Don't judge a book by its cover, is what I'm trying to say. This thing probably looked like this thing, you know, before they touched it up. Well, I'm back from the ramp. Unbelievable. I, I have the worst luck at this ramp. Get down there, it's getting busy, it's a Friday, pain in the ass, that's why I hate going down there on the weekends. Get the boat in, go park the van, come back, like my battery's dead. I mean, you can see where the needle is. If it was dead, that needle would be way over here. I'm hitting it and hitting it and hitting it and hitting it and, hitting it and come over, you know, I'm like, what the hell? This doesn't make any sense. So I pull the cables off and put them on my other battery. Same thing. So all of a sudden it goes, brrr. you know, that first start where it's not juiced up enough. And the guy next to me putting in his sailboat goes, there it goes. And then that was it, back there. No start. And as soon as I get home, turn the key. It's turning over. All right, 7.30 in the morning. Heading back to the ramp. I did not make it in the water yesterday. And of course, it's gotta be windy. Can't be nice. She's still running. Freaking wind. Oh yeah, baby. Feels good. Oh. I don't know what the hell's going on, if you can see it in this camera or not. It's a phone camera. So like I said, man, this thing, sweet. I'm, I'm gonna get the other camera out, this phone camera deal. Pain in the butt. All right, let me pull this hood off and see how she feels. Cool as a cucumber. Sounds good, she feels nice and cool. There's idle. Yeah, this boat definitely is gonna need some weight in the front. feels good since I rebuilt that thing, cleaned all that crap out and everything. Alright, 
but I'm hearing a weird noise. I don't know if it's coming in over the camera. It's kind of like this, like, like a little tin ear. Try it again. Sounds like something teak. Strange. Try to figure this out. Well, I can't figure out what it is. As soon as I give it the gas, I hear something tink, tink, you know, like this one noise, like tink. Like something might need to be tightened up, which I probably should go through everything. I haven't checked any of this stuff since the day I put it in. That's what it sounds like, like tink. Something, you know, it's a lot of torque on that motor. All right, and it's running cool. It's running fun. Tracking that black and yellow wire down. That idle screw, like I said, is all the way in again. And it's, you know, I tried to turn it with the screwdriver. I couldn't even move the damn thing. Not that it's idling too high. Let's see what my uh, GPS says. Take it for a GPS run. I haven't even hit full throttle yet. So I'm gonna check my idle speed. Three miles an hour, that's what I like. Seemed a little slow. Let's see what she says, babe. First, I gotta get rid of some coffee.
35 with just a couple bumps on the on the trim. Nice. Right, I'm gonna head back to the dock or to the dock and uh, go get my van, get all that crap over with, because it looks like they've got an event going on over there get the hell out of there before it gets stupid, crazy, busy. Yeah, I need some weight in front of this puppy. Here's what number one looks like, pretty good. So here's number two, it looks identical to number one. Not bad. Wow. Nice, right? Number three. They all look great. So I've got my meter on the battery, it says 13.8. 13.0.89, bouncing back and forth. You rev it up here, make sure this thing's charging. Yes, it is. Let's double check. Was I hope I was recording all that? 38 miles an hour. I've got the other little camera going. If I wasn't. Just checking my uh, temp. Yeah, it opened up. Feels good. Yeah, it's choppy on this side. So 38 on this one. Get the hood back on. All right, baby. I can't believe it. Like I said before. Seems like a dream. I've got this thing on here. That's what I was shooting for. You know, a 70. Yeah, this is sweet, man. Sweetness on sweetness. I'll probably get the new kit, the new water pump kit. Go ahead and install it. I just wanted to test run it. You know, I didn't want to go crazy doing all this crap, but something else may have been wrong with it, you know? You put a ton of money into it. Off the bat, maybe this guy wants to race. <laughs> He's going pretty fast. I'm gonna check this weather system right here on my phone and see if it's coming this way. for tuning in to this week's episode of This Old Outboard. Follow the real life saga, one outboard at a time, baby. You never know what's gonna happen next. Oh yeah, baby, tons more stuff coming your way. It's This Old Outboard, baby. You know the channel. Oh yeah, baby. Don't forget to subscribe.